Hey everyone, welcome to Life Thoughts Camera YouTube channel. In today's video, I will be showing you all my tips and tricks on how to open, close and lock a pump bottle dispenser of any kind. I have seen these kinds of dispensers on beauty and cleaning related products. These are some of the bottles that I have right now. This is the pump dispenser that I'm talking about. Do check out this video here for viewing the Dettol hand wash review. As this video progresses, there will be more such pop-ups. Do check them out for more information. And this is actually a bottle that I have repurposed. The hand wash solution is not green. So if you're using this, don't get alarmed. Pump components. This is how a pump nozzle looks like. Now these will vary depending on the brands. But the main parts are the dip tube, chamber, closer, lock ring, and actuator. How to open? Every product is different. So first, check the pump to see if any directions are mentioned. If you see any mark, for example, like the Palmer bottle, it has a clockwise rotating arrow. It means that I have to rotate the nozzle in clockwise to open. Remember guys that the nozzle will come locked and the directions given are only meant for opening. Now I'm going to show you the first method and hopefully it should open. Example 1. Product has an arrow. This is the Palmer's Cocoa Butter Formula with Vitamin E. This has an arrow on the top of the head. I'm holding the neck part of the nozzle tightly with my left hand and rotate the head part of the nozzle with my right hand in clockwise direction. Example 2. Product does not have an arrow or has an arrow mark in both directions. This is the Dettol hand wash. I'm holding the neck part of the nozzle tightly with my left hand and rotating the head part of the nozzle with my right hand in anti-clockwise. Usually, if the bottle does not have any directions for opening, then to open the bottle, I have to rotate the head part of the nozzle anti-clockwise. Now sometimes this first method does not work. The head just keeps turning and it won't pop up at all. It happens. Then I try the second method. I hold the bottle upside down and place my fingers almost near the base and squeeze the bottle for a few seconds. Now I turn it back up and try opening it again by using method 1. If method 2 also fails, here is method 3. Open and remove the pump from the bottle. Wash it under running water and dry it completely. Now I hold the chamber part, not the neck part, okay? And I open by trying method 1 again. Hopefully, this should open. And I place the pump back into the bottle. Do check out my salon style manicure at home video. I feature this Palmer lotion in it. This is a must watch playlist for nail art beginners. How to close or lock the pump. This is also very important. You don't want the product spilling out when it's in your suitcase, right? Again, for this you have to remember the mark of the nozzle. For example, the Palmer bottle has a clockwise mark and the pump does not pop out like a dead all bottle. So to lock such a pump, I just hold the neck and rotate the head anti-clockwise. See, now I'm not getting any product. And guys, don't forget to wipe away any left product from the tip of the nozzle. For example 2, I'm using the Dettol pump. See the pump? It is popped out. So first I have to press the pump all the way down, then I turn the nozzle clockwise. Keep in mind that whatever product is left in the nozzle will come out when I'm pressing it down. And that's it guys. If you're interested in lifestyle, do check out my other videos. Now, don't forget to thumbs up. And if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe. And then hit the bell icon to receive all notifications. Bye!